Hey, what's up guys? This is the Russian Genius and in this video I am gonna be showing you a card trick which you have already seen in the trailer but I will be showing you this once again. So you take the Ace of Spades and you place the Ace inside the center of the deck and now you find the Ace by using a pretty interesting technique that actually looks like this. You pop out the ace just like that and there should be the ace of spades and then if you want you can take it one step further by finding the remaining three aces and you can do this move which I'm gonna be teaching right now and this is a pretty cool move to make it look like you are finding a random card in the deck. This small pop out is a pretty cool move and you're able to pop a card out just like that. It's pretty clean actually and let me show you this once again. Just like that and there is the Ace of Clubs. So that is something that I really want to show you today. If you enjoyed this video hit the like button, subscribe if you have not, comment below Below as well I will be replying to some of the messages let's move on into the tutorial here's what first of all I am gonna be teaching you I am first of all gonna be teaching you how to do this how you are able to make a card seem like it pops out from the center of the deck like that. There are a few ways of doing it. Here is how I do it. Here on top of the deck I have the Ace of Spades and here is what you are going to do. You are going to use your index finger to spin the card from the deck. Here is basically how it looks like in speed, alright? In speed it looks like this, but what is actually happening is that, here is the Ace by the way, what is actually happening is that you are are slip cutting the top card like this and then your finger is throwing it out. It is kind of similar to this card shot where you do it like that but the difference is that in this one you're holding it on the side and you take it like this and then you slip the card, you throw the card out. Alright, here is a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you do this move. You put the deck on the table just like that, there is the ace of spades on top and then you're gonna hold the deck like this, alright? Your index finger is gonna be on top and what your index finger can do is your index finger can do this, alright? You hold it like this, the other hand cuts half out out and you take everything with you know you take the top card with the index finger and then you're gonna do this motion and then you let go and the card shoots out of the deck and it looks really visual. Another variation of doing this, this is gonna be the last variation before we move on into the trick. Another variation of doing it is by doing it like this. So instead of cutting the deck like this, you actually cut the deck like this and then you do it. So some people, they actually like to do it like this. All right, and I've never been able to do it like that, but I do know that some people they do actually do it like that. Let's move out. Let's zoom out just like that. Here is how you do the remaining of the trick. It is actually quite simple. For the remaining of the trick, I'm gonna be doing it with the yellow fontaines. If you wanna buy this deck of cards, then check out the link in the description because I do sell these cards on my website. So, let me show you how this is with this deck of cards. What I like to do is I like to start off by placing the ace of spades in a random position and controlling it to the top. You can control it to the top however you want. This is what I like to do in the trick. In the trick, I take out the ace of spades and I tell the spectator, look, I'm gonna take the ace of spades and I'm gonna put it 
inside the center of the deck and now I am gonna find it that's what you can do in the beginning and the ace is actually on top so you can control the ace of spades however you want to the top of the deck I'm gonna be showing you a few ways on how you can control the ace on top of the deck while still having these cards on top all right this is gonna be quick the first way to control it is of course to use a pass you place it inside the center and then it is on top and the other cards are also on top the other way of controlling it is by using the double undercut if you want once you have the ace of spades on top of the deck then you are going to do this pop out that i just taught before like that and then you can tell the spectator that the card that flew out was actually the ace of spades and they will get surprised then you can tell the spectator do you know what's better than one ace and then you tell them boom two aces just like that bits you know you can say whatever you want but you know it's it's pretty cool and it's pretty visual a lot of people they actually get surprised by this i am trying to do this move without throwing the card too far away from the screen and that is kind of difficult in my opinion but i should be able to do it without any problems so here is basically what um is gonna happen you are going to do the move once again and there is the ace of hearts and what i like to do is i like to throw you know a few false cuts and a few shuffles like this i just like to do it because it makes it seem like you actually know what you're doing and it makes it seem a little bit more impressive so that is the trick i hope that you enjoy this i will try to do this in speed and then i will quit the video once again there is the ace of spades and it is gonna be controlled to the top however you like it doesn't matter at all all just like that and then i am going to pop out the ace of spades from the center of the deck or that's what the spectator thinks so just like that and then they get impressed right there and then you can tell them you know what's more impressive than one ace uh, two aces that should be an ace you can tell them to flip them over and then you know they get mind blown like boom just like that they get really mind blown or they should at least get mind blown and then you can i mean to be honest you don't have to produce the aces like this you can also produce the aces a little bit differently you can produce the aces like this you can say look snap my fingers and there's the other ace there are so many ways of producing it you can even just do a double lift and you can tell them oh five of hearts that sucks it sucks and then you can do it like this and then tell and then say boom voila ace of diamonds look at those four four aces we found them just like that uh, so that is the trick. I hope that you enjoy this. It's actually quite simple not too difficult at all Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you enjoy this video uh, Make sure to like comment and subscribe once again if you want to buy these playing cards Check out the link in the description the RussianGenius.com. So thank you for watching and uh, I will see you guys in my next video Check out my second channel right over there.